For me, I think uh, sub 61. <laughs> no. <clears throat> um, man, this uh, this world half came at the right time. You know, you know we were gonna do uh, San Jose half marathon just uh, five weeks before New York City marathon. Um, but I, you know, I, in the back of my mind, I really wanted to do a really fast half, uh, go for a fast half, you know, fast half marathon, hopefully for PB. So when this opportunity came, I was, I was, I was very excited, man. I was excited, you know, I wanted to go run a fast half. When that opportunity came about, I was just like, no way, you know, it, it, everything is just kind of coming together uh, so fast uh, in very unexpected ways that I'm very grateful for. Uh, so just to get an opportunity to represent this country, which has given me a, a, a great life and a great opportunity to chase a lot of dreams, um, it's a privilege, it really is. I mean, not many people get to do it. So I'm really stoked, I'm stoked to represent a whole country and uh, to do it with some of my teammates and especially all in the 5K and then we got fits up uh, doing the half marathon. So I'm really stoked to just you know go to Europe, uh, Eastern Europe, I've always wanted to go there and so Latvia especially. So uh, really stoked to uh, be representing the country. I've never really competed, you know, at the world level. Uh, you know, even though uh, I ran the Rotterdam Half Marathon, but this is the, to get an opportunity to represent my country, uh, you know, at the highest level. It's, uh, it's an opportunity I couldn't pass, so I'm, I'm excited to, to compete and get an experience uh, competing uh, with some of the uh, uh, the best in the world. It is a pro, pro debut, it's a team debut, it is a U.S. representation debut, it's everything debut, I feel like. And uh, a year ago today, um, you know, I didn't know what lied ahead. It, it was probably the most uncertain future that anybody could expect, at least in my head. And uh, to be where I'm at today, I'm just, I am, I am blessed. You know, I've always heard of people saying, uh, I'm living the dream, but today I really am reporting back living the dream. And it's been a year. It's been a year of ups and downs, and uh, and now it's uh, it's it's really a lot of new milestones. And I'm just really excited. Uh, I'm really excited to be. Uh, setting aside the work life and say, you know what, I'm gonna put everything into running and chase dreams, and and I have one of the best teams in the world to be doing that with. Beside of you know competing with some of the best and really experienced, I want to run a really fast half, uh, and a fast time would be you know sub 61 be a. Uh, uh, the goal that I'm going for. I always love the roads. I, I think, to be honest with you, I enjoy the roads a little bit more than the track, even though I want to kind of stay on the track as long as possible. It, it's a great, uh, I think, build up for the track season, when, especially when I'm racing through the fall and, 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 and roads. And so um, it's really a good way to stay healthy, build good momentum, and stack up some good miles. Just, I'm very grateful, you know, um, to have the opportunity uh, to represent. This will be my first time representing uh, U.S. Uh, you know, at the world level. So I'm very, you know, grateful and, and excited, and, and really looking forward to uh, represent my country, you know, uh, at, at that level. <laughs> yeah.